Okay, it's Buddy T. Anybody that's out there catching fish every now and again, you get some little bags of bass or crappie or some sunfish, whatever. Well, it comes time to use all that up. This is one of them ideas. What I did here is I cubed up a whole bunch of fish. Catfish, there's some saltwater fish in there. I diced up two of them Anaheim peppers in there. I got two tablespoons of uh, Bayou Bass, flour, and two eggs. And that was three cups of fish. Now, I'm over at my daughter, so we're going to make it fancy. So I added some crab meat because we've been catching a lot of blue crabs down there on the Redneck Riviera. So what I ended up doing was uh, made some patties out of that. Put them in that panko breadcrumbs. And so you got you one of them fish burgers. We're going to put them in here and let them fry off. And, and once you make that burger, you can do what you want with it. You can put it on a couple pieces of bread. You can have it on that plate straight up. I'll leave that part of it up to you. Let me go ahead and fry some of these up. In the meantime, Scott, think about what kind of topping you'd want on yours. We'll see y'all in just a little bit. one more time because it's so good. There's three cups of fish. Cut them up small 50 cent to quarter size. Put two eggs in there, about a cup and a little bit of flour. Then you're going to put two tablespoons of that Bayou Bass and you can go and put Old Bay seasoning and Louisiana crab and crawfish boil in there. You're going to make your patties then you're going to put that in that panko breadcrumbs. So that's going to make a real nice crust on there. I had that two of them Anaheim peppers all cut up in there and I took the seeds out of them this time because those were kind of fiery. But anyway, it gives you something to do with all them little packages of fish you got left over because I tell you what, this is one really good fish burger. We put crab meat in it. You can do that if you want a crawfish because it ain't going to do nothing but get better. Come on down, Scott, because it's worth the flight.